To do a video covering getting audio out of reason so there's a couple of ways that you can do this so this is a track that I've been working on recently and I'm still mixing at the moment but just wanted to give you a few ideas of how you can get the audio out and some of the options that you can use so this is the track that I'm playing with at the minute <laughs> So what I want, maybe want to do is, is bounce this out. Now, whether I'm at the mixing stage or the mastering stage, I might want to bounce this out, go listen to it in the car or wherever else I want to go and listen to it. So how do I do that inside Reason? So if you go up to File, there's an option in here to export song as audio file. So if you do that, you can give it a name. It can be a, a WAV file or you can create it as an MP3. I don't recommend doing that. There are, there are better ways to do this. Um, so if you go back to uh, file, there's something called bounce mixer channels. If you choose that option, uh, you'll get this dialog box around bouncing out mixer channels. Um, and you can see inside the top left sort of list box up here, we've got all of the channel strips you can see in the SSL. So what I can do in here is I can start to choose which particular channels I want to export out to a web. So let's say I'm going to send this off for mastering somewhere. I can check all of these boxes. We'll come back to the machine channel in a second. But I can bounce these out as individual WAVs and I can send those as a collection to whoever's doing the mastering for me so they have greater control over, over the master that they're doing for me. Or I can come down here and you'll notice there's a, a, a section called master section. If I check that, and export there that will give me the track in in wave format that I've chosen here so um, before I do that though one quick tip here is you'll notice it's called master section which you know if you're bouncing out a few tracks for your EP you don't want every one of them called master section when it's bounced out so one thing you can do here is you can go back into reason and you can find the master section if you right click on it you can actually create a, a track create track for master section. If you do that, right at the top, you'll get this extra lane in the sequencer. What you can do is, is you can give that a name here, and then when you bounce it out, I'm not giving this track a name yet, but um, it's called just TT1. But here now, that will be used when I bounce this out. So if I go back to bounce master section, what I tend to do is uncheck all, all here, so I've got explicit control over the ones that I am bouncing out. And you'll notice now it's not called master section. It's called my name and then the name of the track. If I was to check that and export that, then that would be um, named that way appropriately when it's bounced out. So bouncing out is all about just getting the audio out of reason into a particular format. Now, whether that's um, in WAV format or a AIFF, uh, which is audio interchange file format, then uh, that's up to you but that will get that exported out to your laptop or out to your PC so if we go back into bounce again as I said before I can check and uncheck these depending on which I want to send out so if I was just going to send out uh, the whole track I could choose um, um, the master section which have been appropriately named now also down here you can choose what range to bounce so We've got left and right locators here, so I created a little loop when I was previewing the track. I can just bounce out that section if I want to, if I choose loop, so left to right locator, or I can do the entire song, which will go from start to the end marker there. So um, that's one option. Bounce to, so I've got new track in song, or I've got audio files on disk. Make sure you've got audio file on disk. You'll notice if that's selected, your file format comes into play, it's not greyed out. I'll show you what new tracks in song does in a second. But if I was to choose audio files on disk, top right, I've always got all selected. I'm not going to go into these options here, maybe apart from normalize. I tend not to have normalize on because depending what I'm doing around mastering, once I've mixed it, 
I'll be maintaining those levels myself and if you push that too much there you're not going to leave enough good headroom for, for the mastering process so I tend to leave that unchecked there down here again depending whether I'm bouncing out a mix to go on to mastering or whether I'm doing the mastering in the master section using some plugins I'll choose the bit depth here notice if I choose 24 bit dithering goes away but if I'm doing a final mix here let's say I'm mastering the whole thing which I don't normally tend to do uh, I'll bounce out a mix to a WAV and then pull it into a separate template where I do the mastering uh, I would choose 24 bit here and dithering goes away so clicking OK here once you've got all those things set up is it will just ask you where you want to put it tend to just bounce to the desktop as you can see from previous options if I say OK here what it's going to do is it will just go away and it's going to bounce out that entire track you can see the indicator moving along as it's doing it so what you'd expect at the end of that is just a um, a WAV file produced onto the desktop another option you've got inside bounce is um, the ability to bounce to new tracks in song so let me give you an example of that so the kick and the percussion here I've laid down in machine so I've got an actual VST here that's got a machine in there now if you notice at the moment it's turned off here okay because what I've done is I've bounced out the percussive elements and the kick to wave that I'm then using inside the song if I turn this on and I play this if I just solo out the machine Okay, so what I can do here is, is I can go back into bounce and depending which channel strip you've got selected in SSL it will automatically check which mixer channel to, to bounce for you so it's kind of working out that I may want to work with the machine 2.1 drums and percussion so what just to quickly show this here rather than bouncing out the entire song if I go for loop okay I'm just going to go from the left and right markers here and rather than to audio file on the disc in a wave to 24 bit I'm going to go to new tracks in the song a couple of options here but just to show the, the basic functions of this if I say OK now what it's going to do is you'll see it, the indicator move along and again it's exporting the bars as we can see here but rather than a physical file being created on the disc what it's going to do is, is create me a new strip down here with the bounced out wave audio in there so if I go back up to here and I play this I can solo this bit out but if I go back to machine here I can turn that off there and we'll still get we still get this wave playing here so rather than having to have the VST running I can just point this out into a channel here and I can uh, use it that way So that's pretty much covers bounce to mixer channels um, again like I say if you check all of these you're going to end up with a bunch depending on how many channel strips you've got and I've got quite a few on this track you're going to end up with 20 25 different wave files that you can then pull into audacity and you'll see the whole makeup of the track you can then send them off if, if you're going to pay for it to be mastered um, for the individual channels on there like I said there's some options on the side where you might want to exclude some things uh, I'm not going to go into those today but um, pretty much that's the basics of bouncing out audio uh, from reason um, for, for mastering purposes or just you know bouncing it to an mp3 or web for you to go listen elsewhere uh, as you're working on the track if you like this video and some of the things I've been covering recently uh, on this channel please subscribe I uh, look forward to doing some more videos yeah. Damn, damn, damn.